Welcome to the CCSN channel. Our topic for today is insulin resistance can cause high blood pressure. My name is Abuzar Habibinia. I have an MD degree and I'm the director of the Canadian Academy of Sports Nutrition. Subscribe to the CCSN channel on YouTube to enjoy the information that we share on a weekly basis about medicine, weight loss, fitness, and sport nutrition. Okay, today I'm going to show you how insulin resistance can increase your blood pressure at the end. Unfortunately, insulin resistance is on the rise worldwide. There are lots of reasons for insulin resistance, and I'm going to have a video about the causes of insulin resistance soon. So if you have developed insulin resistance for any reason, it's important that you take care of it, you try to fix it, otherwise at the end your blood pressure is going to go up. Insulin resistance is basically is this. Insulin fails to function normally. Insulin is going to sit on its receptors but doesn't work properly. Insulin is a hormone that is released uh, by the pancreas and has many, many functions in the body, but the most famous function of insulin that I'm sure most people uh, know it is that it's gonna lower blood sugar level. But as I said, insulin is going to affect many organs and uh, systems in the body. But let me show you how if you have developed insulin resistance, your blood pressure could go up at the end. You see, in normal people, let's say in healthy people, that they have not developed insulin resistance, insulin is going to affect the arteries and is going to lead to vasodilation. When vasodilation uh, happens, blood pressure is going to go down. On the other hand, in healthy people, insulin is going to affect the kidneys and is going to increase the reabsorption of sodium in the kidneys, which is going to increase blood pressure. You can see in here that insulin has a sort of two different uh, effects on blood pressure. By affecting the arteries is going to lower blood pressure, by affecting the kidneys is going to increase uh, blood pressure. So we have over the sort of balance. But when you develop insulin resistance, this is going to happen. For some reasons that is still we don't know in medicine yet, in insulin resistance, this function of insulin, the e, basically the effects of insulin on the arteries will be lost. I'm going to put in here. This function of insulin will be lost. The function of insulin that basically was supposed to lower blood pressure will be lost. This one will be kept. That's why in people with insulin resistance, blood pressure is going to go up at the end. This is exactly the main mechanism why in people uh, with insulin resistance, if they don't fix it, blood pressure is going to go up. However, there are some other factors that they contribute to high blood pressure in people with insulin resistance. I'm going to put at the uh, top corner for you, there is a hormone in the body, it's called angiotensin number two. In people with insulin resistance, this hormone is going to go up. And also in people with insulin resistance, uric acid level is going to go up. Uric acid level is going to go up. So, in people with insulin resistance, blood pressure is going to go up. Uh, basically because of the effect of insulin on the kidneys, and also because this hormone, angiotensin number two, and uric acid level, they have gone up in the blood, they contribute to high blood pressure in people with insulin resistance. So we know at least three mechanisms by which why insulin, uh, basically insulin resistance, uh, is gonna increase your blood pressure. This is the main mechanism, and increased angiotensin level uh, two in the blood and increased uric acid level, definitely they have a minor role in increasing blood pressure in people with insulin resistance. I really hope that you learned something interesting today. 
because we make science easy to understand. Now you know. If you don't want to miss our weekly video, you can subscribe to the CSSN channel on YouTube. To support us, you can share, like, or comment on this video. Until next time, stay safe, stay connected.